mm. Hearst Castle. Hearst Castle. One of the most iconic properties in the country, in, arguably. In, in the world, maybe. Yeah. In the world, yeah. Uh, that's like the Versailles of the United States. Now, this is probably one of my favorite rooms in this house. I always wanted to have a two-story library because why wouldn't you? Look how cool this space is. I mean, ton of hand-carved woodwork. Every corner is so well detailed out. Mikey, can we get a close-up on those um, beams, exposed beams with all the hand-carving details? It's so unique, so rich in character. Yeah, um, this is kind of what I always associate with estates like this when I was a kid is these big, you know, beautiful wooden library offices. Uh, it's really nice. This is incredible. And I mean, you have a wraparound second story where you can walk around and access all the bookshelves. We have the desk set up right here, TV on the left-hand side. And of course, we have the art French doors opening up to the backyard right behind the desk. Overall, ton of beautiful wood paneling, wood work. Fireplace right here to cozy up the room. Now, Mikey, there's another detail here. Why don't you point to ceiling for a second? Look at all those ceiling medallions and all the details in the plaster. Yeah. They actually match that design on the floors right here with the carpet. Isn't that amazing? I hadn't noticed that. Yeah, that's really cool. I mean, it's incredible. Ton of details. All right, let's move on. Let's continue our tour. So we have these double doors right here, opening up to the billiards room. This room has hardwood floors, beautiful Spanish carved ceiling details. I mean, ton of character. I believe that's an egg and dart uh, crown molding detail around, darker tones, base cutting on the walls, chandelier right here, right on top of this beautiful uh, pool table. Now this pool table, I believe one of the three original Brownswick pool tables. I'm not expert in this field, but I have been told that this pool table is pretty significant. I believe it's from like the what, 1886 or something like that. Yes. Yeah, it's over a hundred years. Also that mantle fire, fireplace behind you. Yes. When they were building the Hearst Castle, they used this fireplace design also over there and they brought it here as well. And they were, when they were remodeling it. Well, yeah. So the original owner of this, uh, and I guess not the original owner, but William Randolph Hearst, when exactly. he bought the home, he remodeled it and moved this. He from, didn't remodel it. He brought a lot of European elements. To yeah. The home. And he moved this from uh, his castle, which is up uh, near San Francisco. Yeah. Um, Hearst Castle. Hearst Castle. One which, of the most iconic properties in the country, in, arguably. In, in the world, maybe. Yeah. In the world. Yeah. Um, that's like the Versailles of the United States. That's know? right. Uh, and, anyway, mean, he brought this here. Yeah. I mean, look at all this character and details, Mikey. This is incredible. I mean, so cool. All right, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you want to watch the full tour, make sure to check out the video right here. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next one.